Hello friends, welcome to my channel. Today I will show you how to insert or create new slide in PowerPoint. Once we open the PowerPoint, here we will see the already one blank slide is present. In order to insert a new slide, just go to home and here click on new slide option. In new slide option, we have total 9 templates, namely title slide, title content, section header and so on. Now I will insert title slide. Here we can see that the title slide is inserted in which it gives the space to write the title as well as subtitle. Whenever we create any slides, before that we must prepare the information or data to be write, written in these slides. I have written some information which is regarding computer network. Let's write the name of the title as computer network. If you want, you can also write the subtitle. Once we write the title, here we can, here we have font tab in which I can change the font style, I can change the font size, here I can bold it, I can make it italic, I can put the underline and one more important option which is present in the PowerPoint is the text shadow. Let's see how it looks. Select the text and when we apply the text shadow, here we can see that the shadow is going to appear on our text. Similarly, we have one more option that is character spacing. Here we can adjust the space between the characters. If we click on tight, the space between character is going to reduce. Similarly, if we click very loose, that increases the space between the character. In this way, we can choose the space between the character. I will click on normal. Now, I will insert one more slide. In order to insert one more slide, just click on here and go to new slide. Now, I will insert the second slide as content, title and content slide. Click on it. Here, we can see that here I can write my title, here I can list my content. I will write it as content and the, by default the bullet is going to appear in this text box. I can replace with this different bullet styles or I can replace with this numbering. For instance, I will choose a simple bullet style. Now, now here I will write the content. First I will write definition of network. LAN, MAN and WAN. Here I can increase its size. Just click on this button. It increases its size. Similarly, I can also increase its size. I can change the font style. I can change the font color in this way. Once I make this content sheet, now I can also insert one more slide with different style or different template. I will choose the two content. Click on two content. Here I can insert the title. Here I can insert the text. Here also I can insert the text. Along with the text option, we have few more options. That is, I can insert the table. I can insert the chart. I can also insert the smart graphics. At the same time, I can also insert the picture from file, clip part, as well as a video game. Now, I will write the content LAN, that is local area network. Here, I will write its text. I have prepared its text for local area network. Once I copy this text, I can change its font size. I can also change its font style. Now, I will align this text accordingly. Here in this box, I can insert the table, 
Let's see how to insert the table. If I click on insert table, here I can enter the number of columns and number of rows. Just select the number of columns and number of rows and click on OK. In this way, I can enter the table. Similarly, I can also insert the chart. While inserting the chart, just select the style of the chart and click on OK. Here I can see that I have already created one Excel file and I have already inserted some data based on that data that is going to create a chart. Similarly, I can also insert the smart graphics. Just click on smart graphics. Here I can see that different style of smart graphics can be selected. Just click on any one and click on OK. Here I can edit it according to our need. Similarly, in order to insert the picture, just click on picture. Here I have a picture or land, just click on it. In this way, I can insert the picture. Similarly, if I want to insert one more slide which is of same style, just click on that slide and right click on it and click on duplicate. Here we can see that the same slide is copied. Now go to this slide. Now I will edit this as and in order to replace this picture, just double click on it and go to change picture in format go to change picture and here select the figure for man and in order to resize it just stretch it accordingly now in order to replace this text just select this all text go to your word file and copy the data or the information which you want to put in this slide and right click on it just click on paste if you want, you can also increase its size. Similarly, again I want to copy this slide. I can also use the shortcut key that is Ctrl Shift D which also creates the duplicate slide. Again I will go to the last slide and I will make it as one. And in order to replace this picture, just double click on it once i double click on the picture the format option is going to enable click on change picture and select the figure for wide area network in order to replace this tag select the text again i will go to my file and i will copy the text and just click on paste and i can also adjust the size of this figure and I can also adjust its alignment. This is the different slides in PowerPoint. Once we create the PowerPoint presentation, now it's time to see the slideshow. One unwanted slide is appeared here. In order to delete this, just select on it, press the delete button or right click on it, just click on delete slide. That deletes the unwanted slide. And if I want to insert a slide between the slide 1 and slide 2, just click on slide 1 and press the enter button that creates one blank slide which is of the same layout of that previous slide. In order to reset the slide, just click on slide and just click on reset. If I click reset, that layout style is going to reset and it goes back to the default layout style. Once I apply the different style, now I can view this slide show. In order to view this slide show, just the first one is normal one and the second one is slide sorter and the last one is slide show. Just click on the slide show and this is the slide show. Just click on the slide that is going to change the slide one after another. The once the slideshow is ended, just click on escape, again it goes back to the PowerPoint presentation slides edit option.